Brothers, there's a long way to go. Save your strength. Huh. Jayove, what's wrong? Brother Tai, a storm is coming. Let's turn back. Don't be afraid. Is there a shelter nearby? There is a gorge ahead, but it's the same direction as the storm. Perhaps we should turn back. No, we must reach the outpost by nightfall, Jayave. Tell the others, press on. Yes. yes. Come on, tell the others. Come on. Oh. <laughs> Brothers, press on. A storm is coming. Take cover at the George ahead. Hurry. Move. Together. Huh? 
Your Highness, we just received a word from Beijing. A rebel group from south is heading here. They have gold to buy arms beyond the border. Their leader is called Tayun. Tayun? How dare these rebels intrude on my territory? Capture this Tayun. Sayuwe, look. Bandits! I'll tell everyone. Listen, everybody! Bandits are here! Arm yourselves! Catch! Move on! Take the cargo! Come on! Charge forward! Chief, he's Taiyun. He's wanted by the prince. Wait! My lord! Hmm. What news you have? Run! Come on, run! Man Tian Hong, surrender the criminal. I promise not to press charges. You are just a fourth rank official. Don't interfere in the prince's affairs. Don't try to intimidate me by invoking the prince. Even his highness must treat me with respect. How dare you? How dare you defy me and over the criminal? Let's go. You dare to raise weapons before a court official? 
You can be beheaded for such an offense. Anke and Chi, let him go. Captain Wang? Yes. Escort the criminal back. Yes, sir. Come on. Let's go. Godfather, we are home. Wake up. Have uh, we arrived? Godfather. Uh? Did you have a sweet dream? Sweet dream? What dream? <laughs> you were drooling. Don't deny it. Really? I don't... Uh... <laughs> Master Mao is back! Hi! Hey, Master Mao! Hi! Master Mao! Hello! You hey, had a hard journey. <laughs> Master Mao is back. I've... <laughs> I've traveled so many places, but there's no place like home. <laughs> Master Key! Hey! <laughs> it's been so long. Look what I've got for you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> this is specially for you. Oh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> we'll meet later. Yeah, yeah. Hello there. Hey. Yes, yes. Did you get everything I asked for? Ah, here you are. Thank you. So, is there any progress? Yeah. Don't give up. And listen, use this. This is very helpful. Give it to Zillion when you go to drink tonight. Listen, women are very passive. Men need to make the first move. If you don't act, you two won't go anywhere. It's done. Thank you. But do you understand? Keep it in your mind, okay? Do you know, Anne lays back. Zoo is not here. <laughs> uh, who is there? That's mean. I got you. Uh. Master Liu, uh, I thought you... You thought I was Louis Shui, am I right? Uh, 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 uh. What is this? <laughs> who did this? I said, who did this? Father, what is it? First, wipe yourself. <laughs> oh, this really feels good. Zillian, the wine has been warmed. Don't drink too much, just one jar. Drinking one or two jars, yes, yes. Makes no difference to me. You're in bad health. <sighs> Son, bring pole and chopsticks. That pan, have you asked Wu Zong uh, to fix it yet? He's been waiting forever for you. Do you need to talk about that every time? <laughs> you nag me about drinking. I nag you about remarrying. Uncle Mao, hey, here. Try this out. The pan still works. Go ahead and send it over when it breaks. Mm. Taste good? Mm, very good. You'll be busy at the banquet tonight. So rest well and enjoy your food properly. Mm. Go ahead, come. You should drink less. <laughs> <laughs> Little devil. Hmm. Good wine. Sir, forgive me for asking. Why antagonize the prince over a bunch of rebels from the south? 
to the imperial court they are rebels but to me these men hold the fate of the country in their hands take chinyun to golden valley find master mao i believe he can help him hey these are done take them thank you be careful okay God loves Everyone, all eat. the people in the world. He gave his only son to you. Here is some more food. Everyone, come and eat and enjoy yourself. <laughs> See, this is my son. Thank all right, you. all right. Listen up, listen up. It's time for the ceremony. It's time for the baby blessing ceremony. Let's begin. God bless you. May your life be blessed with health, prosperity, peace, and happiness always. Ha <laughs> 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 ha. Good, good. Here, yeah, here's a red packet for the baby. Come. Let's drink to the baby's health for the baby. Come this way, this way. This is for you. Come on. Come, 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 come. Congratulations. Yeah. Congratulations, yeah, Shigen. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers to you. Good news it is. The meat has gone cold. Wait, wait. I'll grill okay. some more. <laughs> drink up. Drink up everyone. It's a festive occasion. Father, uh, I'll help uh, them to tie thee up. Uh. <laughs> Loser. Mobai. Mobai. Don't hide in your room. If you don't want to join us downstairs, I can stay here with you to celebrate. Here is first birth month, all right? Rangde, is it done? Give it to me. What is it? I want. What did you say? I, I can't hear you. Speak I, up. Be a bit loud. I actually, come on, speak I, I up. I can't that. hear you. What did you just grill? Oh uh, yes, yes. Uh, there is lamb kidneys and meat. Uh, what did you say? I can't hear you. <laughs> Stop teasing <laughs> me, Godfather. <laughs> hey, run! Soldiers hey, just are give him coming. Another drink. Soldiers are coming. Master Run. Master Mao, Wu Chao is acting Run. funny again. I'm saying, give him another drink. He'll oh. be back to normal after a good nap. <laughs> <laughs> Run! Run! Hurry! Better look, it's safe. The soldiers are gone. Gone? gone? Yes, yes, all gone. Yes, everyone's gone. <laughs> hurry up! Hurry up! Uh, go. Friends and relatives, and respected elders, thank you. Thank you so much for coming here today. It's my kid's birth month, and we are celebrating it. So I would like to make a toast to all of you. Cheers! Cheers! Cheers. Cheers. May your son live to a hundred years. I wish the three of you a very happy life. Ah, yeah. Ha, <sighs> huh. yeah. Cheers. Okay, listen. Today is a very special day. It's it's been ages since Golden Valley has had such a joyous day. and it's all due to here to commemorate the occasion i prepared a little something with our community fund i hope you'll forgive me and always remember today jina jauli are you ready begin then begin and here they are ah! oh what <laughs> <laughs> oh, <that's> fun hey <laughs> <Whoa. Whoa. laughs> hey look there Wow. Look, they are having a great time together. Wow. <laughs> wow, so beautiful. Oh wow. Hey.
मचाए You seem surprised. I want you not to cross me. Surrender the rebel, or your wife and son will die. Don't hurt them. He's gone. Mother, mother. No! I will kill you. Father. You are lower than the princess dog. Father! 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 Father, wake up! Wake up! Wake up! You know the way to Golden Valley. You take care. I'm heading back to report to Governor Zhuo. I am understood. You take care. Come on. Come. Ha! Greetings, Your Highness. Are you here to reward us for recovering the gold? My Lord. What happened to Tayun? He died in a fire during the chaos at Zhao House. He died in fire during the chaos at Zhu House. Where is the governor hiding, Tayun? <laughs> really, that's not what I heard. It's just one rebel. You lost him the first time at Zhu Hao. You watched him escape the second time. You expect a reward for your incompetence? Your Highness, I failed you. But Your Highness is wise and powerful. A thief or two is not worth your attention. After all, we have the gold, right? And we eliminate the troublesome Zhao. You have got everything, Your Highness. Idiot! Without Taiyun, how can I report the court? The longer Tayun stays alive, the longer I must suffer. Did you understand? My lord, please give me another chance. I will go to Golden Valley immediately. I will capture Tayun and get him here. Bring him back, dead or alive. It's your last chance. If you fail again, we both suffer the consequences. Thank you for your kindness. I swear, I will teach this old thief a lesson one day. Chief, have a drink and relax. Prepare the horses. Look, he's waking up.
you are injured don't run around is this place the golden valley who's master mao Hey you injured don't run around like that Master Mao the people here they seem very of outsiders <laughs> each moment's caution is another life saved every moment counts you know that <laughs> someone told me golden valley is a safe place Are you looking for this? It is six tablets for the Huang Huang Gang martyrs, and that's a strange. But no one pays. isn't it true that I know Governor Zhao at first. He may serve the King Court, but I sense that he is a righteous man, a man of unwavering spirit. He knew the gold I lost was earmarked for guns and cannons. He also knew that our mission was to topple the corrupt king court and rebuild a stronger nation. Wait. Take it this tablet. You've made an honorable choice. I believe my comrades didn't die in vain. One day the governor set me free. the prince will not let him go so easily i am afraid that he will be implicated the prince's henchmen they are vicious they are capable of anything and i think we should enough since the governor sent you here i am obliged to give you refuge but then i must tell you that i can't help you recover your lost gold I have no interest in the affair of the world beyond Golden Valley. In my eyes, Golden Valley is all that matters. Master Mao, the gold can save the country. If our motherland is lost, then we have no place to set down roots no, and that's then going too far. You may stay in Golden Valley as long as you observe our rules. Anyone who stays here must relinquish their past and remember one thing once one enters the golden valley one never leaves never again but the governor interested you, you with the task you are injured go and rest i'm busy Call me if you need me. Hey, listen, bandits are coming! Run! I'll get Master Mao. No need to fear. I have no quarrel with anyone here. I am looking for an outsider, a rebel outlaw named Tiun. Surrender him now. Each village has its own rules. Anyone who arrives here is considered one of us. You can't just take who you want to. You will have to follow the rules. Good. You have guts and courage. But it's bad that you are not too bright. How many villages do you have here? A hundred. I will take this one man in exchange for a hundred lives. Shall I do the math for you? Man Tiong, don't involve the innocent. You can take me with you. 
I'm ready to come. Hmm. What's this? A weapon? You don't need a butcher's knife to kill a chicken. We are all God's children. Are you all as stupid as him? Surrender the man. Do you want a war? Hey, Wagon, don't go there. Go ahead. No. Listen. Hey. <laughs> Don't force my hand! For it. Be him. careful! No! Move aside! Mother, oh. run! Go! Run for your life! Oh. Yeah! From here, move. Children, go, go inside. inside now. Hurry. Go inside. Come on. Stop! He brought those trouble to Golden Valley! I'm very sorry. I'm sorry for putting you all in danger. Just tell us why did you come here? Spit it out. That's right. Who exactly are you? The bandits came the moment you showed up. Who told you about this place? It was Governor Zhu. Our savior. He sent him here. I know you all secretly blame me for offering Tae Yung refuge. I can understand that. Every one of you might be worried. But I must remind you of our rules. When someone enters Golden Valley, we don't question their situation or past. Every person has experienced terrible suffering. But why did we all end up here? Our master Liu. His true identity is Liu Shan, the Beijing Sword General. When the Eight Nation Army invaded Beijing, 
the king officials all ran but liu and his brother stayed behind afterwards to appease the invaders the king court threw him in prison that's where that is where i met him exactly there this man here once served in the naval forces as the youngest commander and when the french fleet reached maui he was the first to open on the enemy he was later demoted and exiled to the north and coincidentally i was there too as for wuju well excuse me my stomach hurt wuju is from a prominent family but hates to be reminded so i'll tell you my story instead wu zongye and i met at the ehe tuan society after the zinchu treaty was signed we were persecuted for opposing the king court and later on governor zu helped us to escape without him we wouldn't be here today therefore i am not your savior your true savior is governor zu when each of you had no way to turn he asked me to help all of you tahyun is just like what you were 10 years back we may not care about the resistance of politics but since the governor sent him to golden valley we are obliged to take him in now is that clear we will take him in that case there is nothing more to discuss we offer him protection agreed agreed yes agreed protect, protect, him. protect him protect, protect him. him today it's bandit tomorrow it's king troops they won't leave us alone that is why we are here so let's figure out very clearly what we have to do we already have nowhere else to turn that's right we cannot run so we will fight them fight, fight them, them. head on, on. we have to use our time very well we will have to be very careful about that less than 2 days from washichang yes we must all stay alert zilian lucy escort all women and children to the mountain and take provisions with you all the rest will stay here to fight yes yes, yes. the bandits were taken by surprise this time they won't underestimate us again they will send 100 cavalry units mobile One must know himself and his foe to win a battle. We may be outnumbered, but this is Golden Valley. We will use our knowledge of the terrain to destroy them. Let us strategize. Master Mao. Mumbai. Peter Fang is missing. Where did he go after all? I don't know. But this morning he mentioned that the female bandit leader. was wearing a cross he think that she is a believer such an idiot god lives in people's hearts different hearts have different gods we must all realize that go find him and bring him back hmm. my lord thank you for standing by me thank you for giving me strength please continue bless me please Please offer me peace and guidance, and bring me light. Amen. You have gone astray, but you can still be saved. Atone for your sins from this day forth. Golden Valley is a quiet place. We only hope to be left alone and to live in peace. You and I are both God's children. Listen to me. Don't go. I just want to let you know. We won't suffer the same tragedy again. As long as you are willing, God will protect you. He will always be there for you. Trust me. The cross you are wearing will bring you light. There will be light and fire in Golden Valley. The prince's troops are heading there. You? <laughs> you won't shoot me. Yeah! <laughs> You get lost. Run. Come with me. Move by the prince troop are on their way. We must warn the villagers. Time is running out. Let's go. Let's go. Right here. 
Mark, no! Don't let them go! This way! Come on! Come on! Watch out! So cruel, it is. Keep moving. Come on. Stop! You and I, hmm? both are men, so I am going to stay. <laughs> of course you are. But you have a more important task. You must protect all the women here and all the children who are younger to you. Hmm. Hmm. Don't worry about us. Take care of yourself. Don't be afraid. Just follow me. Be careful. Split up. You go through the pass. Yes, sir. Come on, let's go. Run! Hurry up, they're coming. Ready? One, two, three. Uh. Keep running. Come on, hurry up. Be careful. Everyone, go that way. Hurry up! Go that way! Come on, hurry up! Hurry up! Go ahead! Master Mao, the troops are coming from the pass! Hurry, the troops are here! Brother!
Head them off. Come on. Attack. Where are the people? Just one of you. I'll take all of you on. I'll make sure none of you escape. You're the one who won't escape alive. Attack! Zillion? Where are my wife? And my child? Where's who you are? Oh. 
no, no, no. Did you all see? <laughs> this is the price you pay for harboring rebels. Why haven't they come to save you? Huh? You monster. You monster. You monster! <laughs> God, give me the strength. Help me to endure the pain. Let me not betray you. Oh man, Please. it's so cruel. Help me, God. Don't let me burn alone. How can they How burn, could they him, burn alive? him alive? This is injustice. Someone needs to do something. How could they do this? <laughs> it is my fault that you lived in seclusion to avoid strife and conflict. But because of my arrival, your peaceful existence is destroyed. So many of you lost your lives. But you did not die in vain. I promise to avenge your deaths so your surviving family members can live in peace. Are you avenging us? Are you going to kill the prince? Forgive me, Master Mao, but I must break the rules of Golden Valley. I am leaving. Not just yet. Fighting the prince on your own is... A suicide mission. There are some things which we need to do if we must die. Enough. I'm not interested in your principles. I just know that you want your gold back and the prince dead too. And for us, we want revenge. Our brothers and sisters and Governor Zhu, I'm talking about all of them. That way you're not going alone. Because we are coming with you. Master Mao? I want revenge! Stop staring and say something. Otherwise, I'm going to leave you. Li Zhu, I have so much to to say to you I don't know where to begin hmm let me say it for you Liu Xu I'm going on a mission tomorrow so will you marry me correct well then will you An Li you are just a country pumpkin what makes you think that you are worthy can you promise to give her a good life Master Liu I may not be exceptional or talented, but I'll spend the rest of my life taking care of Liu Zhu. I may not be able to offer her wealth or luxury life, but I can promise to keep happy each day and get her food and shelter. Hmm. What if you bully my daughter? Uh, never. 
I am the one who is always being bullied. Huh? What did you just say? I said I'm willing to be bullied by her eternity. You may be ready and willing, but have you asked how do I feel? Anle, have you proposed to me yet? Huh? How did you get this telescope? Uh, Pastor Fang gave it to me. He told me to give it to you as a love token when I propose. Master Liu, Anle wanted to propose to Liu Zhu today. But knowing we are fighting the prince tomorrow and Fang is still in peril, I just can't bring myself to ask her. I don't want to make her a widow. <laughs> Nonsense. Just promise me, you'll take care of my old father. I will. Let's get married when I return. I can't wait. Brat, did my daughter promise to marry you? Didn't you just say? Didn't you just say? Idiot, I said I can't wait. <laughs> <laughs> Racing battle steeds, a thundering of bows, uniting all under heavens, achieving immortal fame. Pity that my eyes has turned grey. Good poem. Don't you think this is Sin Key's poem? Perfect expressions. It expresses clearly. Whatever's in your heart, then forge your own path. The world won't change by itself. Mumbai, let's forge a new path tomorrow and herald in a new dawn. <laughs> Are you really going to ask my father? Why not? <gasps> Father, Anli and I... Just keep quiet. Go inside the home. Listen to your father and go home. Hmm. Anli, as you know, Shu means everything to me. As long as she is happy, I am in Shu. I am willing to sacrifice my life. I am going to Washi Chang so that she will have a good life and future. Master Liu, I know, but... Uh... You really want to marry Shu? Hmm? Tell me, do you promise to treat her well forever? If you do so... Don't go to Washi Cheng tomorrow. Stay here and take care of her. Master Liu, I will marry Zhu and take care of her for the rest of her life. But I must also go to Washicheng. I don't want any regrets. You don't have combat experience. Once we reach Washicheng, stay close to me. I mean behind me. You don't try to... come out, child. I will, Master Liu. Don't worry that. Hey, daughter Shu. Father? Let's go. Oh. Hmm. 
You are here. Let me warm this up for you. No need. This wine is not for me. It is for you. On the first day when you came to Golden Valley, I asked Artyan to save this wine for you. It was buried under the tree at the village entrance. We planned to drink it together on your wedding day. <laughs> but I must give it to you now. You know why? Because I may not come back alive. <laughs> Promise me, open the jar on your wedding day, regardless of where I'll be. And smell the aroma. I know that you found a man who loves you and I can rest. Because then I don't need to worry for you. So I'll rest in peace. <laughs> Master Mao, you have saved my life. Now you must attend my wedding. Of course. Hey child, are you scared? Don't worry, it's normal to be scared. You know one thing? After I came to Golden Valley, I drank and caused trouble because I was afraid. I never told anyone. Nothing about my past, never to anyone. But I am telling you, I am Taiping Kingdom survivor. As far as I remember, I was prosecuted by the king court. My dreams were haunted by blood and prosecutors. But now, I'm not afraid anymore. Because I know I'm going to do what needs to be done. When a man finds his purpose of life, his fear ends. I hope you will grow up to be a man who knows what needs to be done. Remember my words. Huh? Listen, Wu. I know you like me. Will you marry me? Big brother! Big brother! What are you doing? This belongs to Zillion. Yes, it's the wedding wine you saved for her. She just asked me to marry her. But I know, she did it for you. She wants you to drink this before you leave. Zillion, answer me honestly. Is it true or not? See, you brought all these for me to give in to Zillion. Today, I will say it loud and clear. Wu Zongai loves Zillion. I love her. But I can't marry her. Because I know she loves someone else. She loves you. That's a load of crap. Zillion, 
If I have spoken what's in your heart, just not your hat. It's all right, Zillian. Don't be afraid. It's clear things up for you. Songe. Songe, please don't. Baba, you should tell her. Back when you saved her life and her child's, you also saved her. Heart regardless of what you think. Look at her now. Since she arrived in Golden Valley, she has never looked at another man. Be honest with yourself. I know you like her. I'm sorry. I don't. Because all I have is brotherly affection for her. Zillian, your feeling for me is based on gratitude. You'll find yourself the right man. I am not that man. <laughs> you are lying to Zillion and yourself. There's a huge age difference between the two of us. Besides, we're leaving tomorrow from here. We may not come back alive. Don't you realize that? Or are you so dumb? You think giving a one day of happiness is worth a lifetime of regret, you, you idiot? You just don't understand. She waited for you all these years. She just wants to know that you love her. Even if it's only for an hour, she will be happy. That's how women are. Zongi. If you love her, don't just watch you think is right. Do what she wants.
We have to look for them. Tell me, where are the others? Lahu, did you meet with the men on your side? They should arrive by tomorrow night. Good, good. Children, come quickly. The adults have things to discuss. Hello, hello, sister. Master Mao, everyone has arrived. Sorry for the trouble. I will watch the children. Just take your time. Walk slowly, okay? Be careful. I've reached out to all my outlaw friends. They're also busy recruiting more men. Some agreed to join us, others refused. Some are undecided, I think. But I understand that. I understand. Don't worry. Your friends are all men of honor. Our brothers in washing are living in operation. The prince and the bandits are monstrous. Everyone is barely surviving. Why didn't you fight back? Watch your manners. We are unprepared to go up against the prince. We need a leader and a good plan also. Otherwise, we will sure to fail. <laughs> we understand what's at stake. That's why we must talk this through to devise a fail-safe plan. Then we have to find out where they have stored our gold first. The prince army base is enormous. We still have an pinpoint and headquarters also. The prince is willing, man. If the gold is at the base, he will have to report to the court. If it's outside the base, he can claim it is home. Once we secure the base, he will take his guards to retrieve the gold. We must take their watchtower to monitor the gates for signs of activity. Tell your men to create a diversion in the city at night. My men and I will attack the base after that and draw the prince out. My men and I will take care of the watchtower. Master Mao, our mission is clear. For our sake and our future, let's fight them. Hmm. If we must die, then we'll die in a blaze of glory. Laho, let's proceed once the explosives arrive. What is it? Your Highness, Chi <laughs> Chang has quitted down after the missionary was burned to death. But Ajitu <laughs> hasn't returned to Golden Valley. Something seemed to be suspicious. I investigated and discovered that someone was amassing explosives. The city's rebels appear to be organizing an uprising. With outsiders' help, the death of the missionary has drawn the rebel out. Keep a watch. Kill anyone who looks suspicious. Got it? Father! Your business seems to be doing well. You may have many visitors. Have you switched to dealing explosives? Keep my children out of this. You should have thought about them earlier. <laughs> Come on, get me. So sorry, sorry. Uh, uh. Master Mao, someone has arrived. I'm late. <laughs> How could you leave us? The King Feng bodyguards out the action. Let me introduce two brothers to you, Ki and Tai. It's yeah, an honor. <laughs> They are Shigen and Jinfa. Hey. It's been a long time. Huh. Hello. <laughs> Master Mao. Master Mao. <laughs> Master Mao. Lao and his family have been murdered. Lahu's entire family 
died because of us. We lost another brother. But, but listen, there is one more. And that's me. I will continue Lahore's work. I'm going with you. I have finished repairing the explosives. You mean it? Yes. I am in too. Sister, you're alive. Master Mao, count me in. I'm so glad to see all of you alive. I know you've been living in seclusion up north and just want to leave behind your past and leave your days behind of swordplay also. All of you have succeeded. All of you are successful. Yet you've come here tonight. None of you is here for selfish reasons. You've come to fight for your children's future. As men of honor, we toil away and fight for our families. But in times of turbulence, no matter what we do, whatever we do, we cannot protect our families. You were hiding in Washington. You were hiding in Washington, right? On the surface, we lead a peaceful life. But the truth is that we were blind and deaf also. We ignore the sufferings of those beyond the valley completely. Fortunately, Tayun appeared before us. He made us understand that we have another choice. We can fight back. Perhaps in a few hours, death may part us from all our comrades here. It doesn't matter. We all die eventually, of old age or disease. Isn't it better to go out with a bang and die with meaning and with purpose? We were all young at one point of time. We all had our days in the sun. Is that enough? We must continue to do so. What true men were born to do. If we can do, then our children, grandchildren and great-grandchildren can proudly tell the world about their fathers, their grandfathers and boast about their days of glory. Let's drink this bowl of wine together. If we make it back alive after tonight, then we'll, we'll drink one more. Drink up. Drink up. Cheers. 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 <laughs> Thank you.
Attack the army camp. Go! Your Highness, the rebels have created chaos all over the city. Secure the base and kill them all. Come on, let's go! Master Mao, Master Mao, Tune and his men broke through the rear gate. Split up and follow the plan. Go, okay. go, yes, go. Sir. the gold I don't know I don't know you are getting old you have to be careful you asked me to come yeah the headquarters and where's boys no. No. No, no. my child I will take revenge everywhere. The gold is not in the base. <coughs> Definitely in the church. Take the men there now. 
I'll deal with this thing. Here. Okay. Let's go. Come on. Do you dare to defy me? Our chief said no one sets foot over here. Without her permission, you got it. <laughs> Do you think you can survive with gold? Don't worry about me. Just think about what to tell your ancestors in hell. <laughs> 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 Your Highness, he's the rebel you are after. You too. Don't try to escape. Borga, you are right. Don't try to escape. You stop there! Borga is doomed. You still want to resist? Tell me now, where is the gold? 
I don't give a damn about you sinking bastards. I'm the one who deserves the gold. <laughs> <laughs> Leo's death. Watch out! Be careful! <laughs> come on! Come on if you want to die! Come on! Borga, there is no escape. <laughs> if I can't make it out alive, neither will you. <laughs> Go to hell! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Jayun, your comrades are waiting for you. My brother and I must return to Golden Valley. See you soon. Master Mao. Everything that a man needs is here.
I will never forget these days of glory. Thank you. 